And hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance. I cleared out that area and now we are in Chalimber's something. I can't remember the other part of the name. We're in the next area. And it's kind of like an overgrown rune, essentially. Not rune, ruin, sorry. More of these guys, of course. Probably the most annoying spell that those guys have is the one that poisons you because it forces your character to kind of like. I don't know how to describe it, but um. Oh god, I'm on five potions already, jeez. Uh, kind of like. cringe a little bit because you're poisoned, so it's quite annoying. Now I'm gonna just have to play a smart. Back to having somewhat decent decent potions. Right, okay, done. Right, I can go up that way to the left or I can continue onwards. Let's continue onwards for now. Oh, good choice, because there's nothing here. That was so going to be one of those moments where I went the wrong way. Like, by accident. Right, okay, so... Uh, more of these guys. Okay, come on. There we go. Nice and done. Right. Uh, so we're slowly making our way towards what's his name, Seths or something like that. Seths. I can't pronounce that very well. But that's where we're going. Chillimber's Crown. That's what it's called. Right. We can even go left or right. I'm actually going to go right for once. No, I'm actually going to go left. Never mind. Why was I even thinking? I'm never going to go left. No, right first. Left. Uh, I'm not too worried about this guy. Right, two down, there's another one up here that I can't block against. These firebomb guys are pretty annoying, but they're not invulnerable if I play smart. I'm just not playing very smart at the moment. Right, I'm gonna fall back because that looks like it looks like left and right both take me to the same area. So I'm gonna go and approach that area from the right because it seems like a better option. Alright. Gonna approach this area from the right hand side. Right, now that I'm full up on health, let's actually play smart. Or at least attempt to play smart. Fall back, there's a magic guy. Ah, so much for playing smart. Right, 
Right, area is pretty much kind of cleared. Right, now let's try and attempt this area. Okay, now I'm going to try and secure a side. I'm going to try and secure this side and then work my way down. No, nope, there's a sorcerer guy that way. I know those guys on the left. Actually, maybe it's the left side I need to secure first. If I can secure the left side. Save point here, so that's good. Right. Uh, yeah, I'm going to try and secure the left. Jesus. Right. This area is this uh, this area is proving difficult ish to clear. Oh my god, I just Right, okay, cleared that. I have slaughtered so many of these guys, it's not even funny. Not even funny how many of them I've killed. Yeah, let's fall back, because um, that's a magic guy that's going to do damage. Right, what is over here? More siege weapons by the looks of it. Oh my god, this, this area is massive again. <laughs> so many things to kill! This game is just throwing hundreds of stuff at me, literally hundreds. I am a one-man army at this point. Good thing I got that plate armor. It's a really good thing I got that. Right, okay. I want to clear out this side and then move my way down. Oh, rejuvenation potion, could use that. Let my, I'm trying to not use potions, I'm trying to let my mana and health regenerate naturally for a bit. Don't know how plausible that will be with these guys. Oh my god, Jesus, look at that. Look at that health! Not the kind of potion I need, but I'll take it. Oh, fall back. Right. Managed to deal with that. Let's peek around here, see what we've got. More of these Skitka. Oh, yep. Oh, 
Oh, more. Okay. Great. Right. Oh, come on. That does damage. Bugger off. No way. That's another one down. Another one down. Oh, I need that. But it's quite... Quite surrounded and there's a way out there. No potions whatsoever at the moment. No potions. I've got one of these guys. Two of these guys. Fall back, fall back. These guys have way too much range on those things. Uh, wow, look at the range on that! Did you see the range on that? That is unbelievable range. And they just don't want to die. Oh, I have arrows. When did I pick up arrows? Almost died. Alright, I got that guy. It must have been some lightning. Right, I'm going to quickly run and save. Oh, thank god. Right. So now, if I die, I don't have to fight all those guys again. Right. And there is a way out here. Where, 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 where does this take me? This takes me to the outer keep area. So that looks like the next area that I need to go. Right, so the outer keep. Probably what I'm going to need to do is clear out this entire uh, area of the Chalimber Crown and then progress into the outer keep. But this is going to be a tricky fight while I'm on such low. Yeah, I've got three of them on me right now. Right, okay. This is gonna be a really tricky fight, but it's the challenge is the, the challenge is good. I enjoy the challenge. Uh, I've got, no, I've got yep, got one right there. That's him down. Used up my mana, but that's okay. One of these guys. I need to stop running through the damn fire. Oh, great! One of these guys. No, 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 no! You come attack me! You come attack me! It's the other one that I don't want. Yeah, that was a bad move. Oh, let's grind. We are making very slow progress though. My experience bar is almost halfway up again, so I should be due a level up. Not anytime soon, to be honest. <laughs> More there. Oh, lots, lots, lots there. Ah, right. I've got another two, three coming at me from that end. Oh, 
Right, awesome. We're, do we're doing some serious... We're d I reckon this is some pretty decent gameplay-ish. We're doing no not too bad. Considering I have zero potions. Again. I do want to start making progress though. Across this area. Yep. That is bad. Can I block this? Silly. Ah, I can block the damage from that, but not the fire damage it does after. Right. I'm really trying to avoid using a recall potion. There's a magic guy somewhere down that area because he got me with his poison spell. Here he is. Oh, 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 just walks right into about four of them. Alright, fall back. This guy's he's hovering around the save point. No, he's retreated. That's good for me. Now I can come back in. What he throws, come in. Right, cleared. Cleared out, awesome. I wonder how much of this let's play has been me saving. <laughs> I save so often in this game, I wonder what the percentage of saving is for this let's play. Ah, another one. Okay, managed to take them down. Right, it's these guys that are coming at me now. Come on. Oh, that was painful actually. That was kind of painful. Got lucky there. Pretty damn lucky. So they're definitely they're definitely building siege weapons for an assault on Baldur's Gate. So it looks like the undead, the the beholder, the dark elves, and the gnolls and the ogres were all part meant to be part of some kind of monster army set out to attack Baldur's Gate by the look of things by some unknown, ah well as of yet unknown uh, antagonist. Yeah. Oh crap! The problem with these guys is that they, they blend in. Oh, a healing potion! Oh, thank God! Got a healing potion. Used it instantly. Okay, that's this bit's cleared. We are good to go. The game is really throwing these wide open areas at me for the third act. They didn't really have any of these areas in Act One or Two that were so open to where you want to go. The rest of them are pretty damn linear, to be honest. Right. Oh. Ah! Pick it and go! Get it and go! The range on that is so ridiculous! 
He should be like an Olympic sport. If there was an Olympic sport for being a lizard man who throws firebombs, he would totally be it, man. He would be the gold medalist every year. We are very, we're making good progress. This area is kind of getting cleared out now. The loot, I've got to complain about the loot drop, the loot drops in, in this game for a minute because the loot drops are terrible. Terrible. Really your only resource for getting good equipment is the hub. It's where all your good equipment's going to come from essentially. This is all terrible stuff. Right, okay. Farther on a little bit. Though there's like three of them over there in that area. Can I avoid that at all? Okay, there's a firebomb guy right there. Yeah, I wanna... Go around maybe and see what's down this way. There's probably yep. Again, I never even noticed them because of the greenery. Ah, run, run! Ah, I was just literally just thinking about how I haven't saved in a while. Okay, but I'm going to end this episode here. Thanks guys very much for watching this episode of Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance. I know these last couple of episodes have been pretty grindy, pretty, pretty much slogging through tons and hordes of enemies. But I, we will get there, we will get there. So thanks for watching, I hope you have enjoyed. If you haven't already, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel for further content for myself, Identify. Uh, if you want to get in touch with me, leave a comment in the comment section below or go to any of the me social media in the description box below. I always read and reply to messages and love hearing from you guys. And as always, it was a pleasure to have you, and I hope you take care. See you next time.